Yo, 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 what's going on, y'all? It's your boy Clue here, and I'm back with another video. Well, another tutorial. Um, I know y'all probably seen in my last video I did tutorial in my vlog. If y'all want me to keep doing more, man, just keep letting me know, man. Just, you know what I'm saying, holding it down. But there's really more I got to say. I'm not going to really get into too much. But today I'm going to teach you guys how to make a um, Shawnee Bin Laden drill type beat or K-Supreme type beat because I see K-Supreme kind of getting on that wave too I, I fuck with it so i really been listening to them a lot lately so that's really what my mind been attracted to so shout out to uh cash cobain he really started it with the really with the drill sample so he really started away with that shit so shout outs to him man but um without further ado let's get started i'm going to go on youtube and i'm going to pull up now somebody in my dms they dm hold on real quick y'all Hold on real quick. Hold on. I'm making somebody had recently DM'd me and they had told me to do a uh, Chief Keith Love No Thotty. So that's what we're gonna try to do today. And we're gonna try to do it in like a drill type version. So here's the fun part. So we go into FL Studio or whatever software you use to edit your beats. Um so with the FL Studio version, you're just basically just gonna drag it in here. You're gonna left click twice right click edit in audio editor and it's gonna take you to Edison so then I'm just gonna get the parts that I want this is gonna be real quick so give me a second I'm gonna uh, turn the sound off for right now until I actually get it edited because like I said I don't want to get copyrighted for the song so all right boom let's do it so now I got it to the point where I wanted it and I'm going to uh, left click again and this time you're gonna drag time because you have to get um the BPM right so you just play with it usually it goes in the main 5 9 13 17 be telling y'all like I'm not like no professional professional musicians you feel me so I only can tell you what I can tell you, you feel me like I just like when I started making beats at like 13 like I just I just I learned what I had to learn like do myself, you feel me? Like I, I did a couple YouTube videos here and there, but it really wasn't nothing really teaching me how to do this and that what I really want to do. So I really had to just too much play with it, you feel me? So so I'm gonna leave that five, I'm gonna turn the little um clicky thing on and then I'm gonna play and see if it's on beat. Oh, hold on. Oh, you gotta change the song too, my bad. And I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. You feel me? So now I'm gonna turn it. I'm gonna drag the BPM up because now I know it's on beat. I feel like I'm gonna have to change it again, though. I might have to change it again, but we gonna see. I'm gonna turn the thing off now. Now I'm gonna press plus. Hold on, man. I'm gonna press plus. Um, now I'm gonna press plus, and it's gonna uh, give me a whole new thing. So uh, these are basically like your channel racks, your your drum patterns, however you want the beat to go in your favor. So, <laughs> but um, <laughs> but um, let's see. I'm gonna use some snaps. Yeah. So I'm gonna do it like this. And I'm gonna turn my clicky thing on so I can make sure I'm on beat. Oh, yeah, this gonna be hard, y'all. Hold on. <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna get a hi hat. Now, usually I go in my um. My NY drum kit, but I'm probably gonna use some regular. I don't know. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what's in there. Yeah, I might. Yeah, this is gonna be hard, y'all. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be hard, y'all. Hold on, I'm finna, I'm finna fuck this shit up. What?
Yeah, actually, I am gonna keep it like that. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it like All right, so there go your hats. Now we're going to add the... I like to put my 808s first and then do my drums because I feel like my 808s are more important, like the way the flavor of the beat going to go. And so we're just going to put that in. Make sure sometimes you got to make sure you come in here and turn off use loop points because sometimes it'll double or it'll repeat itself. And it, like, it'll be an 808 pattern that's not supposed to be there. So make sure you check that. And make sure you also, people don't tell you this, but make sure when you come in here, you got three options. You got the waveform, you got uh, the envelope, and then you got the little toolbar. You're going to want to go to the toolbar too for your 808s, and you're going to always want to press cut self. It's going to do it by itself. And make sure you uh, use loop points is off. Them are two important things y'all most definitely need to look out for because you might get a drum pack and you figuring out why is my 808 repeating like that or why is it doom doom you feel me like you don't want that so make sure you stay on 10 with that but i'm finna um get this 808 pattern together so i'm gonna go back in uh oh yeah another thing turn your fruity limiter off that's like so so important like because you might end up mixing some of your master and the fruity limiter to throw your 808s and stuff so off so make sure you do that but um i'm gonna go back at edison i'm gonna fast forward the video because i don't want to get copyrighted hopefully it didn't copyright me for the same pitch <laughs> i'm really snitching on myself but <laughs> it's all good i ain't tripping but yeah let's fast forward all right let's try to see Give me a minute, let's see what I can do. Make sure I copy the pitch. <laughs> copy value. FL Studio made some easy ways to come in here too, but I'll get into that in the next video. If y'all want me to show y'all like the little shortcuts that I learned so far, that it, uh, comment on the video and I'll get this in the next tutorial. Like, what the hell, dog? This shit off like a motherfucker. Anyway, I don't know how that shit happened, but I guess it, it worked, whatever. I'm not finna fuck it. Um, it's important to mix these two because they're samples and you don't want to get copyrighted. So, um, I'm gonna try to mix this one first. Yeah. That's good enough for me. Then I. Feel me. Alright, so let's try to put it together so far. So we got the main part done. I do want to mix my 808s first, so let me get that right because I feel like it's overflowing with the beat. And I don't like that, so uh let's get that shit together right now. So I'm gonna put my drum kits in there, because them two samples I use, I usually put my samples and stuff in my mixer first. So I could just go ahead and get that out the way. Then I can do my drums on top. Um This how you mix, man. Like, it's really not that much. You just gotta have an ear. And another thing, head some headphones and stuff do matter, but if you really got a fire ear and you know what you're doing, like, do what you do, bro. Don't let nobody tell you, oh, that's not how you post to me. That's how. Just make sure the shit clean. That's 
that's the most. It's no rules to mixing, bro. It's no rules to making beats. Do what the fuck you do. That's why it's called being creative. You feel me? So. Now I'm gonna. Now I'm gonna put a multi uh, compressor on here. I put them all bees. Shout out to Galvanize. He uh, taught me how to do that. So shout out to that boy. One more thing I'm gonna add. Nah, not probably gonna be one more thing, but for the drums, like I'm gonna add the kick in there, and then I'm gonna put in the mixer, and then I'm gonna add some little like perks and effects, little shit like that, and then we good to go. Same thing as the last one. See how everything flowing together. Now I'm gonna turn my 808s down too. Same thing. Another tip. It just need to be by zero. And when I mean by zero, I'm talking about right here in the master. If it surpassed that zero, it's too loud. That's a tip for y'all. Some little sounds, little stuff to make it, you know, sound a little, you know, play. How you make a shiny Bin Laden K Supreme type beat? So I'm going to um I'm gonna put hold on you tripping? I'm gonna add I'm gonna just show y'all how this shit just add on and I'm gonna leave it at that and I'm gonna let the video fade out. So y'all like I said y'all want any more man comment like subscribe let the nigga know what's up man you already know here yeah, you can DM me. Don't DM me on no bullshit though, but you can most definitely DM me. Um, and that's it. I'm gonna just let the beat vibe out. I'm gonna just let y'all see how this go. Appreciate it for the love and support. We're on the way to 900 subs. If not, then by I edit this video, I'll probably be at a band already. I don't know, but I just know we're at 880 right now. So I appreciate all the love and support. The folks that was there for me when I was there at like three years four years ago you feel me like this didn't happen overnight so yeah man that's all i got to say so i'm finna just let this video vibe out and i'm finna let it fade out peace no,